set. All right, guys, uh, welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. Um, <clears throat> my throat's a little flimmy. Um, we did chapter one last time, and we are now moving on to chapter two. Uh, for those of you that are just tuning in, have watched the first one, what are you doing? Go back and watch the first one, because, you know, a lot of stuff happened. Um, biggest plot point, uh, Gabe was uh, killed. Um, died in a horrible rock fall accident and the episode ended there as a cliffhanger. So that was pretty traumatic. Um, now I don't know why they, why they did it the way they did with the trailer, because with the trailers, they already like let us know that Gabe dies. So it wasn't like, um, it wasn't like it was, we didn't see it coming. We just didn't know how he was going to die. Just, you know, she talks about how he's dead in the trailer and now we know why or how. Um, I'm going to grab a bottle of water real quick. I know I just started, but um, my throat feels really parched. Not sure if you can hear that or not. Uh, me walking around or anything. I'm not sure how sensitive the microphone is right now. I keep tweaking it. It's not perfect yet. And I do apologize. I know um, I didn't realize it while streaming last time that one second. Um, I didn't realize that last time the game audio was a little bit too loud. So I turned it down a little bit. Hopefully it's a better level and you can still hear the game, but also be able to hear me when I'm talking over it. I'll try not to interrupt cutscenes too much, but yeah. So, all right, so let's go ahead and just jump right into this. Um, I turned the game on and it started playing. Nothing happened. It just, all, the only thing you missed was the title sequence. <clears throat> it said chapter two, and I've already forgotten what um, the title actually was. It was just chapter two, something or other. I'm going to move the microphone just a little bit. I do apologize. Hopefully it's not too loud. Anyway, so let's go ahead and just get right in here. I'm not big on speeches. Oh no, we're at a wake. I've always believed that the role of the bartender I'm gonna cry. Shut up and listen. <sighs> and by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. <laughs> I love when you're able to at least, you know, speeding have fond memories at a wake or to someone you know, on a bicycle before. You can still laugh and enjoy till he came along. Who they were, you know what I mean? He cared Aww. so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. See, he was trying so hard to help her with that and her stupid ex-boyfriend he booked my Had to go and ruin it. to play the lantern all Aww. the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. <laughs> I can recall 14 oh, no. specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. Specifically 14. Okay. <laughs> the first was two years ago. <laughs> so... Long hey, I wanted short, to hear the story. Instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. I forgot to take him up on that beer, but it's fine. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. Aww. I'm sure there were more people. But I only remember him. I'm gonna cry. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. <laughs> See, I, I don't know the context of the story, but I mean, Ducky still makes me the laugh. The fifth so. time. The fifth time. He cared about everyone. Yeah, he did. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He I would totally be best friends with him. He was my best friend. I want to give her a hug. I 
All I want to say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger. I'm not tearing up. Shut up. But he left it as family. Uh, fuck that shit. Like, man, it's fucking games, man. Guess that's that then. What happened to Gabe <clears throat> was a senseless, tragic accident. Yeah. And I just wish it that it wasn't an accident. Ryan, don't. Son, now don't, is not, right not now. the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be huh? sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now. Why did his emotions go off? Now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. Oh, you motherfucker. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Fuck you. Nobody called. Kill him. I want to oh, I want to kill him. In front of Gabe's own fucking sister, Alex heard the whole thing. You piece of shit. Wait, did I hear the whole thing? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. hang on. I got to pause. Wait. Okay, I remember him holding the phone. And I remember him like was he dial Yeah, he was dialing <sighs> shit. Um I don't fuck, I don't remember if he talked to anybody or not. Can I go but no, I don't want to go back and cheat. If I really don't remember, I don't remember. Damn. Um cuz like I mean, yeah, I hate the guy, but like I I don't want to lie to these people cuz if it if I lie to them, it might make things bad later. Um I know he had a satellite phone because I remember talking about it or at least noticing it. Did he actually shit? Oh no. Um, God, did he? Cause he didn't mention a name. He didn't say that he talked to Mac or anything like that, but I remember him with the phone. So, I mean, even if I don't remember him talking to somebody, I know he made made a call or, you know, the call to the, the place. And he said that he called them. He's um, yeah, because he thanks um, Alex for, um, you know, telling him about what happened with um, with Ethan because he wouldn't have been able to prepare. So shit. I don't know. I, I hate Mac. and I, I feel like he did something, but I don't want to just you know, blindly accuse the guy. Uh, I'm going to hit, I'm going to hit myself for this, but I'm going to say not quite. Well, I didn't, I didn't hear Gabe make the call, but he told us he got through. Do you remember that? Well, if Gabe said something, then I'm inclined to believe him, Mac. Yeah. What are you saying? I'm not Rick? saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Draw your own conclusions. Hmm, interesting right, that folks. you know you have a bone to pick with. This is an ongoing um, investigation. How you know, about with Gabe. You the sequence of events. Hmm? Yeah. Son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm. Another fight with Riley, maybe. No, I don't have to take this. Just saying. Yeah, you do. Pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved right? his life. Look, I told you there was no call to miss. Hey, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit! I mean, it's not like it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable. All the oh, time. you shut your mouth. Shut your mouth, Mac. Thank right, you. That's enough. Now I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son. But there was a time. Bullshit, and Dad. This little Everyone's getting calling Gabe red and his own angry. Wake. No, I am just telling you, Mac. I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time, stop it! Oh shit! Stop it now! Damn. This is not the time or place. Where's Ethan? Like we're all here for Gabe. Maybe maybe they thought he was too young. No, he should be there. Okay, Ryan. Sure. I'm I'm sorry. Oh my God. It's not. I'm just. Trying... 
ah, this these games are just so rough. Like I just uh I'm not the one who killed him. <laughs> Aren't you though? Oh fuck you. What the fuck did you just say? Well that was fast. Oh, that escalated really quickly. Oh. I thought I heard that you were the one. You shut the hell up. No. No, go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. Come on, guys. Don't make me intervene. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. Hey. Wait, was that supposed to happen? It, it, that was a really abrupt cut. Okay, so what I was going to say was, I mean... Mac's story alone and his motive and everything, that's enough that's enough for like police to at least look into it. Because that's that's you got motive, you've got um a re like a well the motive is a reason, but you know what I mean. Like he's got motive to want for you know to get back at Gabe. That had to be rough on Alex though, with all those people in that room expressing emotion at the same time, like Damn. Is it Steph? Alex? It's Steph. I love her. Excuse me. Hey. Hi. Fuck those guys. I don't want to. They're. I mean, yeah. Ryan's decently attractive, but Mac is. Ugh. Are you okay? Not really. Um. Let's be. Yeah. No, she's not okay. Like, not. <laughs> God no. I'm a fucking wreck. Now, keys. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I couldn't help it. Thanks. Well, I did hear that. Do I don't know if it's true or not, but um, I feel like I remember hearing see. something about how you can kind of choose um, Alex's sure. like love interest, which is really cool. I, th I think it's really awesome that you can kind of make it your own instead of being forced to be, you know, one thing just because you're you know playing as a character. Um, I like that you can kind of choose your own sexuality i think that's really that's really cool that's really inclusive in my opinion because like i know the you know the first game you got the like love interest between max and chloe and same with stars? um before the storm there was you know um chloe and uh rachel rachel amber i totally forgot her name i'm sorry what was the question oh she's asking about the guitar um it was a gift sort of it was a gift from Gabe. Cool. <laughs> Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. <laughs> Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. Yeah, he's such a goober. It's a really old timey uh, foosball table. Ta really table. I can't say words. Um, because like you know, modern By ones it's more it? plastic instead of little wood figures, but <laughs> was wood was like the the norm. Anybody. Wish I could have seen it. I know she's got the one tattoo. I wonder if she has any other ones. Because you can't really, like, see anything except for, like, that one tattoo. She seems to wear a lot of uh, long sleeves. I mean, it is Colorado, so, like, you're not going to have people running around in short shorts and tank tops because it's too fucking cold. She strikes me as somebody that would have, like, sleeves or at least, no like, way. quite a few arm tattoos. But I could be wrong. I can't. See, I wonder it. if they were ever a thing. Like, they talk about being best friends, but they seem really close. Like, maybe they they had a thing, and it just didn't really progress to much more than maybe a few... Uh-oh. Like, I feel like they, they might have gotten together at um, least once, and maybe they just decided that yeah, they were better off uh, as friends. No Something down, about Alex. that not trophy... Yeah. You're fine. Kind of triggered her a little bit. 
Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. Can I get closer? Power of emotion. Or empathy would be the better term. Oh, that's cool. Like, I'm seeing it through her eyes, so now everything's like dark and rainy. Oh, well, that's sad. Now I can find out what's really going on with Steph. Her sadness is so strong. I hope I can help. The sadness is strong with this one. I don't want to talk to her yet because I, I think I have to figure out what's going on first. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. <laughs> okay, so they played foosball to decide whether or not um, she would stay here. Interesting. And I didn't, she didn't strike me as wanting to leave at any point. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. Oh. So, maybe they did hook up? I mean, I might be reading too much into it. Maybe they, it has nothing to do with them hooking up or anything, but it just kind of feels like there was some kind of, you know, something more than just friendship at one point. What are they called da, again? Da, 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 Don't da, da, shit da. my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm! Badass! <laughs> That's awesome. I don't know if I could listen to a band that's named Don't Shit on My Yard, but I I dig it. It's fine. Foosball. <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You okay, so that's what happened. 50 bucks. Okay. Is there more? Um. So they're like, honestly, I thought the, the bed might have something because maybe they, you know, did the deed. Oh, here's the thing. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I moved. I feel like I'm doing this out of order, but it wasn't like a you, set what? order of events. I think I know enough to help her now. Okay, so from what I'm gathering is that she, well, she said she's going to Denver because of say a job um anyway so either way she's going to or was going to denver and she was planning on leaving and he convinced her to stay by a round of foosball he won so she agreed to stay well, that's cool i like that i already look at yeah it's the video game never mind so help still can't believe he's gone yeah He's the whole reason I'm still... I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. Let me help. I'm a good listener. Okay, so we got video game, foosball, drink, and music. I know she's really, you know, partial to music because she's a DJ and everything, but there's more. there are more items that led to foosball. Um... And that was kind of what triggered her in the first place. So it might be good to talk about that. I'm gonna go with foosball. What are you doing? How about a quick match? Oh, I thought we were gonna talk about. It. Well, no, because I can't talk about it because she has no idea that I know. Did Gabe that wouldn't make sense. Played? Um, sure. He totally told me. I didn't just. 
read your mind and like play back memories because I have magic powers. I'm just saying, I had a hunch. I just had a hunch. Yeah? Well, you're right. I feel like having a hunch is more impressive than just being like, I yeah, you told me you played, so let's play. I'm not I'm not letting up, sweetheart. Like, no. Fine. There you go. Now the real question is, do I let her win or will she see through that? First to five points? If you say so. Or do I whoop her ass and then this game requires quick No, I don't want to skip, I don't want to play. Up, 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 up. Okay. So how often did you and Gabe play? Yeah. It was one of like, our favorite games. Oh, I can't. It moves on its own. I can't actually like control them. Oh mm -hmm. shit. Yeah, there we go. One for me. Score one for Alex. There's band, two. Right? All right, I shouldn't like yeah. demolish her. Oh. Would you play? Drums. See, we could start uh, a band. How long did you? Because I play band? guitar, and she plays drums. Gotcha. Fuck. Fuck. I keep forgetting which ones do what. Shit. I'm not throwing the game on, pr on purpose, I, I promise. The controls are honestly a little weird. Oh, you didn't even try on that one, sweetheart. All right, I'm gonna let her, I don't wanna make it look like I'm gonna win. Shit. You better, okay, I was about to say, you better hit that. That, did you see the ball speed up? That's not how, okay, I tried to let her win. Like, Five really? Points. Maybe you, you can't lose, yep. I don't know. Big shocker. That was weird, yeah, it, it was going really best. slow against that one wall and then I it like mean, shot upwards. It wasn't my best. No, I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing. Okay, don't push don't it too hard, Alex. You're gonna make her upset again. Oh. Is that how it is? Going down. Wait. Um. I want to make it about okay, her. Okay. Joking aside, playing this stupid game with you is exactly what I need right now. Aww. You're on. I think they would be good together. I really. Oh, I don't want to skip. But yeah, no. I I actually think that they would be good together. They, like they're they're cute. I'm actually trying this time. So you better. Are you really? This. Because uh, earlier you were like, um, want you just kind of letting the ball go by you, which I almost like just that. did. Suck it. Fuck, I hit the wrong one. Greatest Northwest band of all time, go. <laughs> I, Are you Northwest band? I don't, me? I don't know. Well, she is not. distracting me. What if I just hit all the buttons? Hey, like, Kenny, if you were wondering. I'll just do this. <laughs> Wait. I always hit the... I, I get these two mixed up. Oh, that was a good shot, though. Damn, she is getting a little bit more into it. Alright, I was trying to compliment you, and you just let that ball go by. I'm glad neither one of them are uh, foosball spinners. If you spin the thing, you're cheating. Like, that is a, a common law of foosball. And I will not hear an argument about it. Like, if you just, like, just, I, I, you know what I'm talking about. Just grabbing the thing and just wailing. Shit. I'm talking too much. Oh, yes. But you know what I mean. If you just spin it really fast and just let the ball go, that, you game. can't do that. I don't know. Oh, come I mean, on. You know Gabe would never let a tie stand. Right? Well, then it's settled. Stop asking me to skip. I don't want to skip. I want to play. <laughs> this is it for all the marbles. So many for all marbles. the marbles. So many marbles. The kind of game you want to focus on, no matter what happens. What are you gonna do? Like show me your tits? D fuck. I'm gonna kick her ass. That's what I'm gonna do. She's in a better mood. I can hey, win. So are you into girls or what? Uh, um, maybe. Oh, 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 um, uh, I'm uh, both. <laughs> I'll date anybody, assuming they're my type. <laughs> What's your type? I'll let you know when I meet them. 
I feel like, um, real talk here for a moment. I feel like me personally, um, I kind of lean more towards the, huh? Well, I, I don't even know what the question was. Uh, what? What was the question? Um, I'm gonna say what? What? Fuck. Oh, did she say loser say what? How old are you exactly? I was trying to have a, a deep moment better. here for a minute there, but um, I'm, I'm really behind. Hang on. Um, what I was going to say, like real talk for a moment, I feel like me personally, damn it. Oh, <laughs> I can't even talk about it. Never mind. Finally, the house of Chen crumbles at last. I actually really tried to win there. Um, she was distracting me and I was trying to have a real moment with you okay. guys for a moment there, but. Thank you. Um, You're she, she kept than distracting Kate. me. That's no fun. Sorry to spoil the victory. <laughs> what I was going to say was that me personally, I lean more towards the, I guess the, um, would be the pansexual, um, spectrum. I, I'm, I'm attracted to personalities personally. Like, yeah, I do find, you know, different you people exactly what physically have. attracted. Of course, Every, everyone has something that they're physically attracted to, but, credit. um, I'm the one who really needed it. I'm much more attracted to personalities and like, you know, who you are as a person. Um, which like, and the reason I say I lean towards the pansexual spectrum is just cause there's so many different kinds of, um, what's the word so, sexualities you know, and everything. And so I, I haven't fully mean? figured out what exactly that I am personally. Mac cause like, lying, right? I like people for their personality, but also, um, on the physical side of it, I'm more attracted to, you know, to, to women. Um, so there's that. And she said something about Mac, right? Yeah. Oh, she said that um, Mac's full of shit. So I know he's a liar about certain things, but I, I just don't know all the info. So I'm going to say I need to learn, learn more. I'm not sure what Mac's deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night for myself. There you go. Gabe. Yes. I've got your back. No matter what. Thank you. That means a lot. I should head back to work. Cool. Like, um, just still on the, uh, sexuality spec um, stuff. Um, like for characters in this game, like I find, um, Steph, ex like Bye. she's gorgeous, but I'm also, I, I, I find, uh, Gabe's personality. I found that very attractive. Like I, I like goofy people. I found him very attractive for that. And yeah. So just giving little examples of me as a person, I guess. I'm bad with words. It's fine. I'll just, uh, I'll just be here. I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? I mean, is he that vindictive? Like, I know he's a piece of shit, but like, to be, like, being vindictive is one thing, but, oh, I can clean. I got excited about cleaning, but is he murderous is the question. Like, he's just a dude, like, as far as I know, but he might be a murderer. I don't fucking know. See, I can be a person. Because one thing that doesn't add up is because um, cleaning up my room it has consequences. Okay, whatever. What I was going to say was um, if he had actually talked to Gabe, I'm sure Gabe would have said, hey, don't set off blast. There's a you know, there's a missing child up here and we've got like multiple people out here looking for him. Like he doesn't have anything against any of them. He just has an issue with, um, Gabe. Also, she's in a different outfit. I just realized. So do I have other outfits that I can put her in or is it just the same ones from before? Oh no, it's different. Okay. So we got this standard black. I don't hate it. Ooh, I do like the green. Green's my favorite color. Wolfies. I, I like that. It's a little too, there's not a whole lot of color though. This looks like a flag of some kind, like a foreign country. <laughs> I do like the green pants though. Ooh, DJ Kitty. Eh. 
I like the shirt, but that's about it. Splat. Oh, I do like that. Oh, those are my choices? Okay. I do like the uh, the Wolf Squad shirt. Pants look comfy. Um, I like the green. So I noticed like the outfits aren't like super different. Like I know that I um when I got the Ultimate Edition, I unlocked a bunch of outfits. I don't know which ones I actually got. I didn't really um remember what they were, but I know these are the outfits. But like they're not different clothing. It's just different colors. You know what I mean? It's kind of like um. It reminds me of Jedi Fallen Order, where you got there were some different outfits, like you get different ponchos and whatnot, and some different materials, but for the most part, it was mostly color schemes that we were, you were getting. I'm gonna go with this one. I like it; it's very cute. Shoo shoo. Thanks, shoo shoo. Thanks for sticking around. I don't want to like go look at all the Fuck. other stuff I've already seen. I just got him back. How can he be gone? Make it stop! It's too sad. Ugh. <sighs> can't feels like Bag? a million years since oh. that day with Gabe hasn't even been a week the kind of person who got that worked up over a college essay could be capable of almost anything fuck him like he's such a prick I don't usually like to wish death on people I but I kind of hope Matt dies practice. Oh, that's right, I lost. Was this snowboard here before? It would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. Or whatever. I was about to say, you sound like a poser saying that. Like, that didn't sound like a legit uh, thing to say. <laughs> you served him well. Oh, not the At album I got him. have a few good moments. Sorry I didn't play along, Gabe. Oh, no. Now I feel bad. I I should have danced with him when he threw the broom at me. I I am so I feel so bad about that now. Thank God for this thing. We'd never have found Ethan without it. Is that a bra? Did I, oh, that's right. I'm a girl. <laughs> hey, it's Fury. He's back. What's up, dude? I wonder how she's really holding up. Well, yeah, he's still dead. He's not going to come back to life. <laughs> Gabe used to swat the controller out of my hands if he thought I was going to beat him. Jerk. Gabe really meant the world to Steph. I'm still I'm still holding on to the theory that they may have uh, gotten together at one point. Hey, who knocked over my puzzle? Wait, did I, did I do that out of like rage or something I don't that, that didn't actually happen now it's all on the floor I was I was gonna find that extra piece hey TV dinner living off these is not great but it's better than leaving the apartment yes much sadness clean this up so long depression food I mean TV dinners that's depression food that's lazy food that's just feel-good food it's just it's an all-around kind of food man all right, why is cleaning things having uh, consequences? I mean, good or bad. Like, I don't understand why that would be considered something that would be an action that has consequences. Let's clean the dishes. Wash, wash, wash. Do you not have anywhere to put those? Oh, they're probably drying. I'm stupid. Uh, what did Fury say? Home clean mind. Right, Dr. Lin? I mean, I'm pretty sure he, well, he, I, I know for a fact he would have died regardless. Um, okay. They said so in the trailer, that so. Did make me feel a little better. Maybe uh, cleaning the consequences are that it improves my mental state. Possibility. Is there other stuff I can clean? Not Glasses. Toast at the moment. Um, I mean, there's like clothes all over the place. My panties are on the floor. Kind of, uh, kind of a dirty, fucking messy person. I was, I was gonna say dirty person, but yeah. <laughs> um, less rotten food too. Yeah, that's that. That is very true. Unless you, you know, what I really hate is when you uh, make food and then um, 
you forget that you put leftovers in the fridge and it just sits there forever and gets all moldy. Ugh. Um, I'm just wandering around at this point. Oh, is there any like memory things I can look around? I keep forgretting to do that because I can find secrety memories. Let's see, walk around with my wooshy ability. Right, dude. Like, if I don't immediately see it, like at the edge of the shelf in the fridge, I forget it's in there. And then, like a week later, I open the fridge. The last few days, it's time what? to get the truth. Okay, I'll get to that. But like. I'll forget it's in there and it just sits and rots and then I start smelling crap and it's ugh. No, thank you. All right, so I don't see any like hidden secret memories or whatever. I think. Hey, what's that? I have mail. You have mail. Uh, who's this from? Oh, Jed. Alex, I'm having a small event for your brother tomorrow. Not Didn't we do that? Oh, I must have just not pick this up before the, the wake take all the time you need I love him he's very sweet yet again let me know if you need any groceries I'll cover oh my god why is he the greatest person ever can he be like my new dad father put ice and alcohol at your own risk thank you I'm so glad that that's their slogan <laughs> I, I I don't like liquor on rocks i really don't i don't know why it just it waters down the taste and i don't like the like mix of like the warm liquid that's touching the cold glass it's too drastic of a change now if it's already chilled i'm okay with that but i just i don't like it on ice can't do it thanks jed alex i'm so sorry apartment's yours for as long as you need oh you know where to find me if anything comes up tip your bartender if you can't maybe add too much does he have all these like um like stamps for these letters? Wait, what did Fury say? Uh for, forget about the ship, we'll get hell to pay. What is that from? I don't recognize that quote. Wait, um, I don't want to go downstairs yet. Can I go upstairs? I can. Cool. Ships. Oh, okay. Still don't know what the quote is, but cool. <laughs> oh, okay. I should know that. I feel bad. I should know that. <laughs> I think this is the first time I've been up here since um, we had that little heart to heart chat about my superpowers. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. Like, holy shit. Like, this view. I would pay any amount of money to to live in a place like this that little silo looking thing looks kind of dangerous just kind of on stilts over there but that fucking mountainscape though i i've decided that i'm gonna move to colorado i've i'm deciding that now i already love the place because i've been there before but this is just breathtaking I'll just do a little slow motion swoosh across the landscape butterflies like this would be an amazing place to live there's a little cart down there with a dirt bike and flowers and other shit I'd take a little boat on this uh, little lake here but she's living here for free like this place is awesome like a place like this would cost probably more than I make in a month <laughs> Let's see, is there other stuff to me? Wait, wait, wait. No, I don't want to leave yet. I'm still looking. Sun and moon. Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture and That decoration reminds me of my mom. She was really into, like, lunar stuff. She likes sun art and moons. Really into moons. I mean, she named my little sister Luna, so if that tells you anything. And get some answers. <laughs> Empties. I'll toss those soon. I swear. So obviously it's been a few days because it kind of feels like it time skipped a little bit no birds today. from his death to the wake. Because the apartment had been changed a little bit and is that really the Colorado flag? I don't know. I don't feel like I remember Colorado looking different. 
Gabe was such I mean, a, a dad. grill? Button? What does a button do? They press it. This thing's been up here a while. Oh, it's a button Isn't button. That okay. Old band? Drugstore makeup. I'd listen to them. And not only because I have a crush on Steph, but you know. I'm not biased or anything. Putt putt! I want to putt! There's a lot of alcohol bottles up here. Golf fun. This isn't golf. This is like makeshift putt putt. You can't tell me that Gabe was never up here with a golf club and a golf ball and wasn't like just whacking him off this roof into that lake. I would do it. <laughs> I think there was an interaction I could do with the chair. Sit. Let's sit and ponder. I could sit here for hours and just look at this view. Pretty sure music's supposed to be playing, be but again, it's the copyright shit. Finally, despite all the disappointments, I really let myself believe. I believed you completely. I let myself hope, really hope, for the first time in years. Even after I freaked out in front of you and hit you, you didn't push me away. He sat right there and told me that I I'm going to cry, that I was special and I belonged. Uh. Then you died. Then I don't know what. To OK, do. see, that quote was from the it trailer. I remember that because they, they talked about that. And, and she let's talk about how he died and stuff alone. Life is strange, more like life is terrible and everyone you love is gonna die. Exactly, that's just that's just life, dude. <laughs> this game might have supernatural shit in it, but it's definitely got the real stuff in it too. Like, damn. Tugs on the heartstrings, man. But yeah, like I uh, I've I've said it before, but like I really wish they had kept his uh death out of the trailer. I feel like it would have been more um of a shock. Well, I guess let's go see what everyone else is doing. Agreed. Do I have to cut through the apartment or will it take me right downstairs? Because that'd be cool if it did, because I don't have to do two loading screens. Ah! Speak of the devil. Wait. No, nope. I thought it was downstairs. Damn, that would have been... I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense, because they don't want you to... Um miss anything. What do you say? Steph tugs at your other strings. Yeah, she does. It's my type right there. Creative hipster emo chicks. Oh, yeah. That does it for me. What is this emoji you put? A creepy black and white head with cat ears? Or is that devil horns? I can't tell. My... Monitor is a little bit far away from me. <laughs> oh, it is cat ears. Okay. Another thing I'm into is cat ears. <laughs> Not me wearing them, but, you know, girls wearing them. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's, she's a good example. She's a, she's a very good example of my type. It would be kind of weird if I had gotten married to someone that's not my type, which I mean, people have done that before. So <laughs> this place is kind of a wreck. Is Jet even here? Oh, I'm by myself. Huh? So wait, so I just thought of something. Oh, wait, my type is like Spike from Cowboy Bebop. Yeah, yeah, uh, that Spike's a good looking man. And like that voice, that'll do some stuff for you. Oh, you were saying you're like <laughs> I thought you were saying that Spike was your type. My bad. <laughs> I like a woman that can kick my ass. Yeah, that too. <laughs> I was just assuming that you like Spike. <laughs> I mean, you know, I don't spoil the pain. 
hey, it, it it doesn't say anything to say that 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 to admit that someone is a, is an attractive person. Okay, that doesn't say shit. Anyway, meatballs. Wait, no, those are pigs in a blanket. I can't see apparently. Got donuts and cantaloupe and some weird cheese and meat tray and some deviled eggs. Not a bad bad layout. I really want one of those donuts though. Anyway. Is it chair? Pretty heated back there. Pick it up. I'll do something nice for Jed since he's been super nice to me. Up oh, there he is. Oh, hey kid, you don't have to do that. I don't mind. Too late. Want to apologize for all of us. We're all Oh, he's got a military tattoo. No excuse. It was your Looks like he uh, might be a marine tattoo. I think. listening to a bunch of fools squabble. Let's saw it for a second. That yeah, that looks like a marine's tattoo. I hate Mac, but I'm not gonna just pin everything on him. It's not all his fault. So I mean, say this. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. You didn't have to say no, dead brother. You could have just no said version. your brother's wake. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. Wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk to. Matt. I mean, she's not, but I know he's lying. Yeah, that's true. I just don't know why. <laughs> I feel like it's a little redundant to say, find him? um, Hell, a dead person's wake. Because you're not going to go to a living person's wake unless you. you're like faking your own death or some weird shit. I feel like I should warn you though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for, if you get any at all. Just don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. Fuck Mac Loudon. He's a shit. Thanks for looking out for me, but what else am I supposed to do? That's not what I, I, I had an like for you. That, that doesn't sound like the same answer, but whatever. But. If you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. <laughs> Charlotte wants to see you. Dirty Harry. And one more thing. Oh, is he giving me a key? To give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. Oh, wow. This Jed is too good for this world. Like he's just letting me come and go as I please. I love him. Um, I mean, I probably should, you know, offer some rent. What about I rent? I mean, I'm going to be working for him. I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Aw. Thank you. I love him so much. <laughs> Buzz, buzz. Hello, Marco's Pizza. I have no idea what to even say what to him. What did Ryan say? Okay, oh, wait, I already read all that up there. Okay, so so sorry, I should have saved him. I don't know what to say. It's terrible. Yeah, really needs to talk to me, dude. Take a hint. I'm not into you. I am into Steph, sir. I mean, Ryan's not a bad guy. They, they, they've got some decent chemistry. Oh, there's a lot of messages. Holy shit. What did Charlotte say? Sorry, you don't have to respond, but I just wanted to tell you. Thank you for saving me life. You are welcome. Why am I not responding to it? Well, I mean, I just went through a pretty traumatic event. That's fair. Ducky! Dear Alex, it was very much my pleasure meeting you this evening. I hope you find a welcoming home near Naven. Sincerely, Reginald McAllister the Third. Steph. Of course, she didn't say anything about um us hanging out earlier. That's fine. That she might have sent that before we hung out. No, maybe I don't know. Riley. Do for you. Yep. Jed. 
Okay, so yeah, these are a little bit old. Oh, May 1st. That was like a couple days before my birthday. 2019. I was... A 20? No. I was... Wait, 2019? I was not 20 in 2019. Wow, I'm stupid. 2019, I was thinking um, to different numbers. Anyway. Uh... I can't do math today. Anyway, <laughs> I can't believe I just thought said the words that I was 20 in 2019. There's no fucking way. <laughs> I was 26. Here we go. I was ready to ditch this place. Hey, don't be mocking my foosball skills. I let you win. Wait, Mac Loudon deleted their comment. What the fuck did he say? Can I, like... Can I... Shut up, Fury. I'm... <laughs> oh, I thought you said you smart. We smart. Okay, you insulted us both. That's fine. <laughs> but seriously, what the fuck did Mac say? I want to read the comment. Probably something snarky and dickish. Anyway, what was I doing? Can I help him clean up? Like, this place is, like trashed look at the memory table I should put something here it's the least I can do can I? Gabe Chen smooth criminal Ta wait what did he do? Um, bicycle speeding on a motor uh, motorcycle bicycle dear god This is a joke, right? Like, how do you go 35 miles an hour on a bicycle and then get charged $80? Taking perp to Black Lantern for questioning. Oh, this is when um, uh, Pike was talking about, it was at the wake where he was saying that instead of uh, actually get like, give me a, uh, gave a ticket, he bought him a beer. Okay. So that's the story. Got it. I wish we'd Portrait. had more time. Cougar in area. You like me some cougars. Close. Oh no, it's hideous. Or Ethan. Curtis is Haven's favorite DJ, I bet. I hope Ducky didn't finish this by himself. That almost looked like fireball for a second. <laughs> Maybe so I wait, can, can I find something upstairs to put Ooh, on I can. the table? I'm gonna go get something. If I can Okay, I can fit through here. Come on. Fine. All right, let's go get something from... What can we put on the memory table? Probably the album that I got him. That's my theory. Let's see. Wonder what I can find up here to add to Gabe's memory table. Because I don't really see any other things just kind of lying around. I'm not, I, I mean, the guitar is not an option, but I wouldn't put the guitar anyway because that was a gift for me. Maybe a photo? Maybe I should put this downstairs. Oh, so I maybe I have a couple different options because it says I can take that. Um, Let me see. The photo would be kind of sweet to put down there. Some random shot glass. That's not impersonal or anything. And over here. Sculpture, maybe? Nope. Can't take the sculpture. I mean, that was a gift for him. So, like, why would I keep it? Who's smoking? I don't... My character doesn't smoke, I don't think. Can't do the comic. Can't do the video game. Or the broom. A little weird if I did a broom. Oh, not even the trophy. Well, I could probably give that to Steph if that's an option at some point. And okay, so I can either do the picture or the album. I can look at it. Yeah. I could add this to Gabe's table. Yeah, I'd probably pick up uh, smoking or some kind of um, uh, 
poison. I was going to say sin, but. <laughs> All right. So either the picture or the album. I would say the picture is more personal, but so is the album, because that was like a moment between um, Gabe and Alex. And the picture might be considered almost a little impersonal just because There's they didn't have the best home up here with sentimental. Shut up, Alex. Um, Cause they didn't exactly have the best family life and also the, the dad's in the picture. So he, he is apparently a dick. What did Fury say? Yeah, I definitely know how that is. Um, I didn't really pick up anything like any kind of new, uh, you know, poisons of choice when my mom passed, but um, I was already vaping at the time and I drink on occasion. I don't drink heavily or anything like that. Uh, I can't decide between the picture or the album. I'm going to go. I, no. I'm gonna go with the album just because I feel like it means more between Alex this is and perfect Gabe for the memory table. Or can I do both? I mean, there's no limit on things I could put on. It's my brother. Let's see. Can I do both? You're coming downstairs. Okay, so... Or maybe it replaced it. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, it replaced it. Alright, so I want to do... I'm, I'm just going to do the this album. Uh, what if you say? The memory table. Oh, damn. Yeah, that's not... That's not a, a healthy coping mechanism, but everyone has their own way of dealing with things. All right, so I'm going to take the album down there. It's on my person, but um, where exactly on this petite girl's body am I hiding an album? Hmm. <laughs> yep. I, I didn't really have a relationship with my biological father. He was kind of a uh, piece of shit in life, and he died years ago. And some kind of um, brain thing or something. I remember my mom told me about it, and uh, she she was really like nervous to tell me. But I didn't have a relationship with the guy. To add to Gabe's table. Um, only saw him twice in my life and barely remember what he looked like. So when she told me, it was like telling me a stranger had died, but. see place album perfect a fun goofy album for my goofy fun big brother Yeah, I feel like that song would definitely be a, be appropriate to play here. But I wonder, like, I noticed there's no music. I don't think there's any music playing right now just because, you know, sad shit. But um, I wonder if the music is uh, silenced because I've got the copyrighted music turned off. The Jed's doing. Oh, wait, what's that? All right, Jed, I got to come back here and see what you got hiding. Is that a check? Okay. 800 and something. Oh, 800 dollars. Well, I appreciate what you're trying to do for me, Mr. Lukin, but I'm not staying long. And I don't take handouts. Yeah, about that, Gabe. Just, you never Gabe left. cash that check, like, right now. <laughs> I love that Jed just kept it. He never actually did anything with it. Jed, thanks for being there when Gabe needed you. <sighs> that says a lot about both their characters. Like, it says a lot that Gabe doesn't want to be a, didn't want to be a freeloader and he offered to, you know, pay rent even though it sounded like he was probably struggling at the time. And then Jed, being an awesome person that he is, refused to uh actually catch it. He took it, but he probably had never had any intention of actually 
charging him any money. He probably won't even charge Alex any money. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. I look at uh, Jed. No, look at damn it. Fine, I'll go around on this side. Can I look at him now? Look. No one could blame me. For oh my God. Drink all my sorrows away. Jed, quit moving. I'm trying to look at you and then talk to you. Wait, really? From all the way over here? Okay. I've only known Jed a few days. But he's got my back better than any care worker ever did. Right? Hopefully, things around here can settle down again. That is true. Yeah. That'd be good. He's definitely uh, very sh strong and very um, positive, uh, like, fatherly figure. Is that a link to uh, Hurt by um, Johnny Cash? Irving. R M and T B. <laughs> I wonder who they were. R M and T B. Um, nothing comes to mind. If we've met those characters yet. They look happy together. Do they? He looks kind of grumpy. That's my late wife in that photo. Oh. Not a day goes by that I don't miss her. Aww. Uh -huh. But these last few, they've been hard. I can imagine. Can I hug him? I, I want to give him a hug. Hey, there's beer choices. We've got Pine Light. Don't know what that is. Old Mill Amber. Ice Fish Pilsner. Double Spoke Double IPA. Kremlin Bitter. And something Flat Iron Ale. And a few others. Cool. Neat. What's this? I think Gabe had more fun at his job than anyone. <laughs> yeah, Ducky strikes me as the kind of old person that's like, oh, did I ever tell you the story? Yes, you did. 500 times. I can't believe Steph actually drank that bedazzled kiwi whatever the fuck shot. I wonder if it was any good. She says she didn't like it, so. Oh, I can actually play the songs now. What's this one sound like? What? What about John Denver? Oh. <laughs> and Fury's getting started. <laughs> right, I think that's all the things I can look in here. Or look at in here. I can learn how to talk. Hey, there's a picture up there. Can I look at it? Looks like a wedding. It might be Jed's wedding. Hey, there's a gun! Can I use it on uh fucking Mac? Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> a skull. Jet definitely has a decorating style. I'd call it steakhouse chic. That's a very fair assessment. I could see that being hung up in like a Texas roadhouse. Alright, we can leave now. West Virginia. A player in your group started a party. That was fucking specific. Okay. Is that um? Jed that looks like I that's Riley. Find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. So Charlotte said. I think I need your advice. Um, I will trade you advice for some dank weed. Wait, somebody else said something. Wait, how do I go back to... Okay, Steph. Wait, 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 wait. What? What? Hey, it's Steph. Um, oh, wait, I already read that. 
Hey, do you have a second to swing by the store? Maybe. What's up? Nothing big. I'll tell you when you get here. Smiley face. <gasps> Are we going to make out? I'm just... <laughs> anyway. Ooh, motorbikes. On one hand, there's the open road and the freedom to run away from my problems. On the other... On the open air. road. Okay. Oh, mining tours. Not interested. Oh, you heard about the accident. What's up, my dude? Was it on the news? What was what on the news? Oh, the blast? Where my brother died? No, yeah, I'm the girl no, with the dead tired. brother. You're just going to talk yeah. about it in front of me? Okay, you have no emotions. Yes, Mom. I, I still have a job at Typhoon. They still have plans to expand. Wait, are you the one that killed my brother? Did you set off the explosion? You son of a bitch. I don't even I, know your name. No, Mom. It would not help for you to call them. Uh, son, uh, do you want me to send a letter to the people at the business? I'll send them a pie. It's gonna be a vote I wonder how many fish Ducky's caught in this thing. How do you know that's Ducky's boat? He's never once spoken to me about boats or fishing. Although he does kind of strike me as someone that would. Let's sit. I said sit. Okay, so apparently this music is not copyrighted, so I can hear this. Do I even want to stay here without Gabe? Where else are, we, are you gonna go? In this like state I've never been to before. This town I've been in for less than a week. You already have people that care about you. You've got Steph. You've got Nothing Jed. Ryan's cool. Go. Back to the nothing waiting for me in Portland. Forget Portland. You don't need it. Too many hipsters already anyway. Fuck. I have no idea what comes next. Yeah, that's that's the best part I'm about life. You don't know what comes next. About Gabe. There you go. At least I know that. <laughs> I'm okay with this music. I recognize the girl's voice. I think this might have been one of the artists from one of the previous games. Pretty sure it was the first game. Switching to CSNY songs? Wait, I feel like I should know that. Hello, ma'am. The park looks fun to explore. Why'd you just look at me like that? What? You never seen a slightly Asian girl before? Huh? Yeah, you keep texting on that stupid not iPhone. You Karen bitch. Kayaks. If not for the paddling, Kex. kayaking would be super relaxing. Kex. Hey, there's a plaque. Sorry about leveling all your mountains. Here's a bench. <laughs> Have a bench. I want waffle fries. Feels so weird to be preparing for a celebration. Oh, but, um, sorry. Where are you hiding, my feathered friend? You're really close to the you. plants Is where. You're looking for a bird. Bird. Wait, Maybe let me talk to her. Cool binoculars. You bird watching? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to win a contest. Oh. You know what I think okay. you're doing? I don't think you're actually bird watching. I think you are looking into that window over there 
Hey, you're a peeping Tom. Or what's the female version of a peeping Tom? A peeping Jane. Sure, why not? What kind of bird are you looking for? Want to be a little bit more specific? Cool binoculars. Uh, okay, we're no, nah, no. Nah, we already had this conversation. <laughs> yeah, I'm walking away. I'm trying to win Goodbye. I don't oh. care. Good luck. Goodbye. What does it say? Wider boyfriend. Since when? Oh, it's oh, they're having a picnic. Sorry, it's cute. What if I die tomorrow? And just like that guy. What have I done with my life? I don't Excuse me. That. that guy. Um, you're talking about you're my writing? brother. Fuck your orange juice looking so drinking muffins. What's the rush? I guess I. No, you're. I'm just right. gonna stand here and ruin your date. You're right, boys. Honestly, like it's a romantic little picnic, but they don't look like they're having a good time. Listen, guys. Um, I can help you with your relationship. Um, so, uh, he's having an existential crisis about life, so you need to talk to him about it. Make him feel better. Look at him. There you go. My work here is done. Newspaper guy. Ugh, this is awful. He was so young. He must be reading about Gabe. Ooh, that is a cool looking sculpture. This is cool. In a wicker man sort of way. What is with her obsession with the wicker man? The bees! Oh, here's Ethan. Hey, buddy. What you doing? He's angry. Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Fuck. Losing Gabe's been hard enough for a supposed Aww. grown up like me. But for Ethan. Hey, buddy boo. Alone. Let's chat. Hey, buddy. Life is not okay. I'm gonna tell you that. Hey, Alex. <laughs> I should ask him if he's okay. <laughs> Do you want to talk about it? I'm fine. You just said you weren't. Well, you thought you're not okay. I heard it. Okay, definitely not fine. Well, was I supposed to ask if he was okay? So, okay, alone. I already got that dialogue. I'm here for you whenever you need me. Okay. Everyone needs to stop. All right, I thought maybe he might it's think okay. something different. It's not. I'm sorry, buddy. Another tree sculpture. I don't think this whole town is a pagan cult, but I can't rule it out either rude <laughs> too bad i can't just run away from all this i mean you technically could nothing's like binding you to this town a legal, legal contract or anything am i supposed to actually find like help this chick find a bird i don't think that's an actual activity good ignore it Let's see what's going on down here. I love that I can actually explore the town instead of just uh, predetermined like little levels or areas and stuff. That might be our feathered friend. Where? Oh. I wonder if this is the bird that woman is looking for. Maybe I should let my binocular friend know. Hey, uh, lady, creepy bird lady. I found your birdie bird. Disc golf. What if I'm secretly a total prodigy at disc golf, but never had the chance to find out? Probably. Tell me you're a hipster awesome. without telling me you're a hipster. <laughs> disc golf. The sport of hipsters. Hey, lady, I found your stupid There's bird. There's a huge bird over by the wall. Seriously? That might be my hawk. Thank you. Nice hawk. I just want to know where she was looking if she was trying to find a big ass bird because she was staring at this bush. Like, first of all, too close to the binocular or with the binoculars. Oh, there she goes. And there's no way you, that bird would have been on that tiny bush. Is that the bird? 
I'm mildly invested. Is that it? Hey. Um, bitch, it is up there. Play the new, oh, God of War. I, you know, I've never actually sat down and played a God of War game. Um, I wanted to play the newest one, but I figured I needed to play the older ones first, but I might be wrong. It looked really good, and I saw the trailer for the new one. It looks pretty good. Lady, you are just clueless. It's You can hear it. It's right there. All right, I'm leaving. You're boring. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. I, I, I just assumed that it was like a continuing story, or at least, you know, somewhat loosely continued. Only small context. Okay. I used to babysit Ethan. <coughs> this whole thing is so horrible. Did you Glasses see guy. Over by the water? There's literally nothing I can do for Ethan. I feel so useless. I've been there. So you know Ethan, but you don't have a name. You're just Glasses guy. All right, catch you later, Glasses guy. Hey, it's Pike. Dude, you need to wash your car. What's up, dude? Pike's really had his work cut out for him these last few days. Game was too young. Just too young. Yeah, I mean, I can play some hack and slash games, but it does get kind of repetitive after a while. Hey, Pike. Hey. Um, how you holding up? Um, been better. Guess I've been better. Yeah, right. Dumb question. Hey, at least hey, he's trying. I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. Yeah, I watched some gameplay footage for it, and it looked, it looked really good. The worst days. Yeah, that's what everyone's been saying. And, uh, when you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. I like Pike. At least he's not um, being pushy about it. I'd say watch a story video on one through three, then play. Two. OK. Yeah, I'll probably end up doing that at some point. Can I go that I probably can't. This looks like an empty area that turn me around, isn't it? Oh, maybe not. Tragically, now isn't the time to check out the rest of Haven. OK, well, maybe I want to. Damn. Fine. Brown Bear Diner. Oh, it's not even open anymore. It's for lease. That sucks. This location gets all the foot traffic. And word around the water cooler is the mining company is about to expand. More jobs means more customers for you. What are you pushy that? saleswoman? Oh, customers here are a lot nicer than in Denver. Never been to Denver, but I guarantee they're nice here. People are nice in Denver. I've only been once, it's very but likely that anything with Typhon will change. They've been the largest employer in Haven for decades. That's nice. I want to go over here. Ski, ski, let me go. Damn. Okay. Red Bear Outfitters. Nice to know. Hipsters can survive at this altitude. <laughs> what are you talking about? They thrive in this kind of like altitude and area and shit. Patterson's General yeah. Store. Okay. Yeah. Hey, do you have stuff? Yeah, we have stuff. Glad to hear it. It's bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening. You're to bullshit, Mister Miner One. You guys don't think anything's really gonna change, right? It's hard to say. I got none of these people have names. Damn thing. I can type in eight years of my life, and they can't give me back one simple answer about my job. Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone. Yeah, that sounds about right. I still can't wrap my head around it. Tell me you're a hipster store without telling me you're a hipster store. <laughs> Sorry, we're out shredding. We're only open from Tuesday to Thursday from noon to six. Saturdays nine to six and Sundays ten to five. It's a weird hours, I have to say. 
I just hope the council passes the vote. Might Tell be her time to check books. out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. I will go to whatever store I want to go to, and I will not be rushed. Thank you very much. Nothing says festive like three exclamation points. I could use more exclamation points. I might be too close to the issue to have an unbiased opinion, but fuck this. Right? There's a wind chime. I have to look at it. Wind chimes. The original jam band. Treasures of Tibet. Huh. I'm assuming they probably sell a lot of incense in there. And some crystals. And... Why are they closed on Monday? One doctor had me try meditation. I always just fell asleep. Well, that flyer doesn't make sense. They're, this is they're closed on Mondays, but... One doctor had me try meditation. Um, they're, 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. on Mondays and Fridays. Asleep. That's weird. Anywho. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. I will Jed get there. Damn. To talk to me. Come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. That's rough. Let it go. Let it go. If I tell him I like him, we'll date. And then we'll break up. And then I'll lose my best friend. Hmm. Oh. Maybe I could help them. Wait. Wait. Can, hell no. What am I thinking? This is not can I? my business. Because clearly he's missing some signals yeah, here. I usually grab a bite with Katie. You should come. Oh, I, I meant just the two of us. That's an awesome mural. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. Yeah, because fuck the mine. Assuming I can't go. Oh, here's Riley. Riley! If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like Because he's what? not innocent. Maybe I can get her to tell me. She seems pretty upset. Hey, Riley. Alex. Hey. Hmm. It's probably open with Gabe. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. Don't say that to Mac. He was like an older brother to me. I'm glad he had you. Thank you, Alex. Really. Um, we'll end with Mac, just because it's probably a touchy subject. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. Hmm. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. Will she be all right without you? She's a tough cookie. But I do worry about her sometimes. She's getting older. One day I'll have to take care of her. Riley, like you abandoned me to go Thanks. to school, and now I'm dying. Now we can talk about Mac. That fight Mac had with turn of the Mac over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of him, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Took you that long to figure it out? Dude. <sighs> um, let's see. Go with this answer. Do you think he's telling the truth about the call? That Gabe never made it? No, I... I it's not that... I... Sorry. 
I'm really not ready to talk about it. Damn. Um, oh, here we go. Yeah, I get it. It's just, if he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? This feels a little bit manipulative because I have like hidden information that I shouldn't have. But I mean, probably good for her to talk about it. He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? That's sketchy. Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. Oh, that's red flag. But he just looked territory so right guilty. there. Like, no. I told him no. And that we were done. Come on, babe. Uh, we got to get out of town. Why? Uh, uh, no reason. I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley. Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. Oh, shit. Um, Fury, I just we'll thought of soon. a theory that kind of makes sense with what you were saying about yeah. Ryan. So, Whenever you want. Ryan did cut the rope to yeah, drop trying to skip town um, is sketchy Gabe. Shit. So what I if I could use that to stoke his fear. Ryan let Gabe die because hear me out because um of not Riley because of Steph because at the bar Steph was sitting with Ryan and they it seemed like they might have been a couple and Steph and Gabe clearly had some kind of past of, of some, you know, emotional attachment thing. So maybe he wanted Gabe out of the picture because of uh, Steph. It's a bit of a stretch because Gabe has Charlotte and, you know, I don't know. That's just a theory that just came to mind. But anyway, I go this way. Fuck Typhon. Hey, there's a gate. What could be back there? Not really in my business, but let's let's do it anyway. <laughs> Damn it. Damn. Maybe there's something around here I can use to get it open. Why are we so enthused as to what's behind here? It's probably just like um storage or air conditioning unit or something. <laughs> Aha! A grabber toy. Oh, it's a dinosaur one. I love it. Rah. I've broken into places for less. Should I really be breaking into this? Like, I don't understand the um, the motive to do this. Fuck it. Okay, it's just someone's back door. Like, should I really be going back here? Probably not. There's a wagon wheel. Yee. Rock me, yeah, mama, like, like a wagon oh. wheel. Um, so this was very, um, anticlimactic. There's literally nothing back here. What was the point? There's nothing in the garbage can. Nothing for me to interact with. There's a table with some cigarettes on it. And a wagon wheel that does nothing for me. Was that just like a red herring? Like, what was the point of that? Like, I didn't even get like a um, notification saying that this action will have consequences. Like, nothing happened. Okay, maybe that'll come into play later. Who fucking knows? It's already open now, so. Is somebody living back here? Even after everything, I never had to live on the street. I hope this person's all right. I mean, it could be just a kid that lives up there and just camps out here at night. Who knows? Probably a homeless person. Anyway, let's go. Bye, Riley. Wait, are you thinking more things that are different? If he's innocent, why nope. is he acting Goodbye. like this? Sorry, Riley. It might be a good time to check out the dispensary. I Dad will go to Charlotte the dispensary. I want to go see Steph first. She's my lady. Sorry about today. 
Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Did I already see what they were thinking? Why should one accident close all the trails? What a wasted vacation. Yes. We're all Oh, sorry. listen here, hiker bitch. For a while. My brother died, died. And you're upset about your stupid hiking vacation? I will shove that bike over there down your throat. You're well, a we cunt. Can try again when I come out with mom and dad for the 4th of July. Don't ever come back to this town again. Get the fuck out. Fuck you. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. I'm going. Jesus Christ. It's like, hey, I should go by the record store. Hey, I should go by the dispensary. I'm working on it. Dingling. Only one bing bong for per customer. She's got to be around here somewhere. Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. Helpful. <laughs> be back in five or ten, maybe fifteen. We're closed. Oh, oh, the cat has a name. Valkyrie. That's cool. I just want to be friends. I pet you? I want to pet you. I'm going to touch your head now. Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakups. Oh, music, sorry, buddy. But maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. I used to have uh, like go-to songs when during breakups or sadness and shit. What would be good for him? Um, what's a good breakup? I mean, I don't know the uh, uh, bands, but I might be able to find something for him. Let's see. I hope we all get to see more adventures of Thanor. Can I find something for him? Like, I, I want to help this this guy out. Hold this. I can't believe he oh, that's the that never mind. record. Fuck. Um, let's see. Doesn't really have me anything to interact with. I want to get him a song or an album. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. Maybe I'll get to hear her play sometime. Still don't see anything that I can uh, interact with to like give the guy a. Something to listen to. Cheer him up. Still going. Hmm. I'm looking. I don't see anything for you, buddy. Maybe she just said that. Because it, it seems like it would be something I could do. Because it's kind of like the bird thing. But I'm not seeing any... Steph said she wanted to see me. She must be here somewhere. I just saw her. I know where she is. I'm looking for something for this... Hoodie guy. Poor hoodie guy. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything that I can uh, interact with. Sorry, pal. I tried. Oh, Steffi. Haven's favorite and only choice for modern rock. I'm glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Hey, I'm right here. Can you see me? Knock, knock. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? Talked is maybe too strong a word. I tried. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. I'm down. Like the one you and Gabe were going to take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. Um... Can we even pull that off? It won't be high production value, but it'll still be fun. I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? Yeah. So, what do you think? Oh. Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun 
defeating. Ooh, good. Uh, tough choice. Storm Rider, or Rither, the Undead, or Gravius, Lord of the Underworld. Hmm. Um, but probably the the zombie one. I'm thinking. Yeah, we'll go with that. Gravius looks pretty badass. Go with that. <laughs> All right then. Oh, I, I got to get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. It'd be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of indie rock coming down the pipe. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. Oh, I gotta fill in a she character. Okay, I'm bar. down with this. So I gotta be the bard. A name of a half elf, and I can choose my abilities. Okay, I'm down. How do I, how do, I do it? I guess I'm in. Oh. Let's start with my name. Alto or Alexandra? I'm go with Alexandra. There's beauty and simplicity. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun. But healing serenade could really come in handy. Hmm. I don't really know what a distortion field would do. Well, she's a bard, so I feel like the serenade one would go better with the character type. Yeah, we'll go with that. Healing serenade it is. Why am I only a level one? Fainor. Um, heroic story or funny story? I'm going to lead towards funny. A wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Oh my god. Uh, oh god. This LARP thing just might work. That music sounds familiar. It almost sounds like John Resnick from Goo Goo Dolls. But it's not. Very, like, that style though but what else do I need to do all right I gotta go to the dispensary Can I really not find anything for this guy I still feel bad that I can't find a song for him to listen to and I handed him the cat like here pet this kitty it'll make you feel better nope all right well the dispensary it is I can open a door Ding -ling, ling ling Bing bong! No bing bong! You bing too many bongs. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. I do. Oh, I'm I'm looking for him. Never mind. I'm like, what? I wonder what Steph's working on. It looks cool. I should DM her and find out more. See if uh, I can help. Oh, she's pretending like I made that. You hush. Okay. Yeah, let's go over to the dispensary first. Might da -da 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 -da. be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed, yeah. A warning would have been nice. Ouch. Time to get my smoke on. Oh, sorry. Huh? Oh. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister. Right? Alex, yeah. She seemed a lot nicer at the bar. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thank you. 
Why'd she come out of there all ominously? Eh, fuck it. Scoodly doot doot. Silver Dragon. Yep, it's definitely a dispensary. Charlotte, Alex, hey. Dad said you wanted to see me. I just wanted to see how you were doing. Um, I am... Be optimistic. I've been trying to stay busy mostly. Yeah. Distractions help. Weed helps. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. He does seem distant. Yeah, I tried talking to him, but he didn't really want to chit-chat. He practically chit -chat. just lost a father. Aw. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting, even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong... Maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. Yeah, that definitely works. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death Escape. I can help. I'm a good friend. What is this? An affidavit. From Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to Oh, to I see. Now I know why um, In exchange that for bitch was there. A big one. It's hush money right there. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith. Witness the greatest right. cover-up in human history. He's dead because of them. And I'd be letting them off. Are you going to sign it? Now, see, what you do is... I don't know. You sue them for double the I'm amount that they're offering you. First, but... What would you do? I just told you what do I would do. Think it would be I would a sue him for extra money. Oh, you're making me decide this bullshit? Uh, <sighs> um, shit. Damn it. Um... See, they have to go and say, take the money for Ethan. Playing the kid card. Um. Like, why can't I do a third option? It's like, you know, turn the offer down, but counter sue them. Well, there's no counter sue, but sue them for extra money. I mean, I don't necessarily think that um, her and Ethan are struggling. I think, I mean, they never really talked about being like hurting for money. She's got a what looks like a pretty successful dispensary. Hmm. I'm going to I'm going to go with my gut. I say turn it I down cuz it's sketchy. Sign it. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you off. Gabe made that call. And I'm going to prove it. I just I need some time. Thanks for being honest. 
That's me. Honesty is key. Didn't mean to rhyme if there, they're but... they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're definitely hiding something. Right? I really appreciate you stopping by. Feel free to take a look around if you want. I shall. Yeah. But I am going to take a quick little break. I'll probably be back in like an hour-ish or so. I'm going to go uh, get some dinner and finish this chapter when I get back. Because they seem to be about like three-ish hours long, as long as I'm not like dicking around like I normally do. So it'll probably be a little bit longer. We're about the two-hour mark now. So we're probably about halfway through the chapter, almost halfway guessing but i'm gonna go ahead and cut it here and i will be back in a little bit after i get some some food in my belly and we'll pick this up later so we'll do a chapter two part two stream for this one so yeah all right i will be back bye bye